Hey everyone, EMC here, and welcome back to Persona 5. Oh, it's been actually quite a while since I've been able to sit down and record, so it's nice to uh, sit down and play again. Haven't been feeling so well lately. But, now that I'm over whatever that was, let's check this plant, because I don't remember if we have before. Perfect! Of course we have some bio-nutrients. Let's get some extra kindness, shall we? Reasonably priced nutrients, you know how to bring life back into the plant? Yeah! Oh, only two. I would expect that to be three. All right. Oh well. Ah. Uh, oh, that's right. We just finished the, uh, uh, like officially becoming Phantom Thieves. Essentially, we have our group. We did our celebration, and we're not going to be able to do anything other than go to sleep, are we? Okay. And make sure the Phantom Thieves is a name that we can hang on our hats. I don't really like that idea, actually. I like the idea of us being anonymous as opposed to being in the limelight. I think that's smarter overall. But some good points were made. If more people are aware of us, then we might give more hope to more people, so... Well, Alright, from tomorrow on, we're officially the Phantom Thieves. I hope we find a big shot we can target soon. Hint, hint. Oh, to the Velvet Room, are we? First off, I'd like to begin by congratulating you. To think our master would give words of praise. You better treasure this moment, inmate! Of course you'd be like that. You have encountered allies who share your aesthetics, and you have found your place in reality. Okay, I still feel that aesthetics is not the word they should be using here. People that share our aesthetics, to me that means people who... Well, like... I, I don't know, like the way you, like... Appear the same or whatnot? rather than holding the same ideals, which is, I think, is what they're getting at here. It just seems wrong to me. The time has come. Your rehabilitation will soon begin. Okay, my rehabilitation will soon begin. What have we been doing? Haven't we already started this? What rehabilitation? Yeah, either of these are, are really like, but yeah, what, what does he mean? What rehab... Blah. I can spoke. I shall explain it to you now. Thank you, because I believe I inquired before and you told me you'll tell me in time. You have a special potential. However, that must be refined into a useful power. I'm assuming he's talking about the wild card, which is uh, the reason why Darren here can have multiple personas. It is weak now, but refining it shall grant you the strength to stand against the coming ruin. Well, that'll be handy, I suppose. That is the rehabilitation cast upon you. Okay, so my rehab is get stronger? I wouldn't call that rehabilitation, but okay. Yeah, well, strength is pretty obvious what he means. Like, Everything else that we've been told and we've heard from him with personas and fusions and whatnot becoming stronger, quite literally, strength becomes stronger. But this, yeah, what's he talking about? There are various means by which you may gain the power to resist the ruin. Fighting shadows and gaining experience is one way. Hey guys, this is an RPG. You may want to grind a little bit. <laughs> As if they're actually just spelling that out here. That's kind of funny. The fusion process I taught you prior is another. Alright, and they are specifically talking about how to strengthen your personas here, not specifically your character. This is all possible because of our master's guidance, inmate. Yeah, because uh, gaining experience is one way, obviously. Fighting and gaining experience to level up your personas, that's one way to do it. But fusing stronger personas to begin with, uh, obviously that's, you know, more time effective and overall stronger. Maybe. I don't know. 
I'm just babbling at this point. Though it may be presumptuous of us, we have words of wisdom as well. Oh? When you're out in reality, you better hone your relationships with those you have contracts with. Work on your social links, people. That'll be in hand that'll come in handy later. Spending time with those people will lead to the cultivation of your relationships with them. If you've got time to waste, you'd better visit your contractor's inmate. <laughs> oh my god. I just hate this girl's attitude. That is another source of power to evade the ruin that our master has mentioned. Thanks to the contracts you formed, your heart is steadily gaining the power of opposition. It seems the rehabilitation is going well. This is a truly joyous occasion. I shall grant you an ability befitting of your newfound growth. Consider it a gift. May the devotion to your rehabilitation grow even deeper. I have high hopes of you. Well, I hope I don't disappoint. Feel like my bond with Igor is growing deeper. I hope that's not his nose. Oh, we can now have eight personas at a time. That's actually nice. All right. Okay. The splash screen here is entirely useless. You now have power stock increases the number of personas you can hold up to eight. Yeah, we got that when we got the power. It said it right there on the screen. What the hell game? Why? The time has come. Return to your brief moments of rest. My brief moments of rest? Oh, man. Apparently I don't sleep well. And don't forget to go talk to your contractor's inmate. Oh, god damn it. Uh, okay. Yes, new people can become confidence. I... okay. We already know this. Like, this has legitimately already been told to us in-game. What is this? Do your best to find confidence. Yeah, yeah, we have been told this already. Probably twice before this. What the hell is with this? these tutorial splash screens? I honestly don't remember this many tutorial things popping up in Persona 3 or what I've played of Persona 3. This is ridiculous, the, the splat, the, these tutorial things, this is ridiculous, oh my god. A broke-ass college student? <laughs> nice. I understand, but nice. Wish I had money, I'd kill for a real breakfast. Yeah, I probably just had curry myself today, so I, uh... Yeah, I'm saying that's a good thing. Actually, I don't. That didn't. Wasn't supposed to sound negative. Have you heard? <laughs> what about the Big Bang Burger? The one on the Central Street is holding a contest right now. Oh God. This better not be a contest of a giant burger and see if you can eat it in time. Big Bang Challenge or whatever. Ugh. If you go at night, you can eat for only 500 yen. That's a nice price, though. Yeah, I gotta eat one of their giant burgers though, right? How can anyone actually finish that? Does it cost more than five yen or 500 yen if you don't finish it? So yeah, exactly, that is a damn good uh, deal. Wow. Huge, if it's a giant burger for 500 yen, again, that's like approximately five bucks where I live. You can't go out and get just a single regular burger for five bucks. So that's a great deal. Uh, I bet giving that a go will increase your guts. I wonder if it's better than uh, than one point at a time. Because if it is, it might actually be worth uh, doing that uh, for guts. Okay, quiet down. I right, like you heard last week, gym class is canceled today. Instead, I'm supposed to give you some guidance. The gist is, don't go around talking about the incident. That's all. Well, thank you for the guidance, Miss uh, Teacher, Miss Kawakami. The police are still investigating Mr. Kamoshida, so I can't say anything myself. <sighs> As a teacher, though, I'm ashamed for not having noticed that a student was suffering like that. 
Uh, I'm not defending him, but as a colleague, he just seemed like, well, a normal person. Yeah, it's funny how these uh, screwed up people like that uh, tend to hide it very well. Honestly, I still don't feel re it still doesn't feel real. If I can read properly, it would be a little more real. I guess people can have multiple sides to them. Oh, I just saw a weird flicker on my uh, recording thing. Huh. That's uh that doesn't bode too well. Uh teachers have it rough, huh? Actually, in this situation, I think everyone has it rough. Oh yeah, I just remembered something I heard about or learned about uh, psychology. Oh great. They say that humans have several different personalities hidden in their subconsciousness. Hmm. Different personalities. Kind of like having different personas. Oh, to be clear, I'm not talking about multiple personality disorder. These different personalities can be a uh, different gender or a different age from you. Hmm. I mean, if you think about how gods and monsters and myths were first based on the human image. If you actually saw one of those personalities with your own eyes, it might look like a monster. Oh ho? Really? Huh. I think that's supposed to be read as like, oh, but I've never seen it written like that before. What? Hmm, you all seem more alert than usual. Did I say something wrong? No, you probably said something actually interesting. Well, I'm just saying what I've heard. Feels like just now... Oh my god, I can... I can clearly, I can read what's in front of me. Feels like I just now understand what I learned long ago. Yeah, it's kind of funny how things sort of fall into place and you, you know, start making sense. Subconscious personalities. It's a fascinating topic, and there's a lot to do with us. That teacher is surprisingly smart, huh? And it's almost like she's a teacher. Oh wow, we just get some knowledge, straight up. Huh. All right. I guess sometimes they just give you a freebie. And I also like how no one seems to notice there's a cat in my desk this entire time. It ain't much, but we've been getting more postings on the Phantom Aficionado website. I want to make my friend apologize for not returning the stuff I lent him. Ugh, deal with that yourself! <laughs> yeah, I figured it, uh, it, as soon as this starts getting around, we're going to have a lot of these uh, frivolous things in there. Oh, somebody, someone's making fun of me, and blah blah this, and... Uh, uh, uh. That's the general public for you. Hey, those girls. You know that Phantom Thieves rumor about stealing Kamoshida's heart? I wonder if it's true. It's gotta be made up. Do you seriously believe they exist? We're standing behind you. But look what happened to Kamashita. He probably just couldn't keep hiding it after that girl tried to kill herself. Uh, no. Yeah, you might be right. I guess there's no way they really exist. Morgana, you're not even trying to hide. Your head is like sticking right out of the bag and you're just watching them. Like, really? Most importantly, it seriously sucks that our school is going to be known for stuff like this. And that right there is another common, uh, common attitude there. Doesn't pertain to, uh, the crap that went down there doesn't exactly influence uh, her directly. So she doesn't care. She just cares that it's a nuisance that, uh, you know, bad press, I guess you can call it. I wonder if it'll affect our college entrance. That really shouldn't, but it actually might. So, I, eh, I'm, I'm just gonna leave it at that. That's probably a normal reaction for now, but they'll see soon enough. Yeah, that is a fairly normal if reaction for now. If two or three famous guys, people will have to believe we exist. So about those big shots, we don't have any leads yet, right? Plus, there's that rumor about you two threatening Kamoshida, too. Yeah, that's probably not going to help matters. Looks like you'll just have to live a normal, honest school life for the time being. Uh, okay, normal and honest school... What, what do you think I've been doing? God, if anything, I've been stopping from Ryuji from being an idiot. Still, make sure you stay prepared just in case anything comes up, alright? Yeah, you hear that, Ryuji? Study. I'll keep an eye out for info on any big shots that might be coming around. 
That doesn't sound like studying. And I'll try to dig up some dirt online. We went and formed the Phantom Thieves group, but we can't even find a target. We've been looking for an evening, maybe? What do you think? What did you think would happen? There, there. I guess sometimes things just don't go the way we want them to. Also, we haven't even been doing this for an entire day yet. Excuse me. Did you wish to see me, Principal Kobayakawa? You saw the state Kamoshida-kun was in, didn't you? It's as if his personality has completely changed. Something is definitely wrong here. I'm not sure I follow. From what I've heard, it appears as though some students were meddling in his business. And from what we've heard, he's been meddling in a lot of students' business. If they did something to him, who could they be? Are you saying that these students may have caused Mr. Kamoshida to change? That is what I wish to know, even if it takes some probing into student matters. Oh, of course. I would like you to look into this for me. It is true that there are many rumors regarding Mr. Kamoshida, but... But seriously? Who is dignified female student here to be looking into that on the principal's behalf like that is not a job for a student in the least that's something like the guidance counselor's job should be doing or something along that like not another student do you mean all of this talk about those phantom thieves it is undeniable that mr kamoshida has changed in some way i'd like to have a grasp of the cause this shall also ensure that I handle the mass media and police in the correct fashion. Oh. I will continue speaking to Mr. Kamoshida myself. Unless you find whomever did this, these irresponsible rumors will likely never die down. Don't you agree? You have been at the top of your class since day one. Your conduct is good, and teachers favor you. I could write you a recommendation for any college of your choosing, Makoto Nijima. Of course. Thank you. Your lineage must certainly play a part in this excellence. Your sister is still young, yet she holds an admirable position at the public prosecutor's office, no? Well, we now know her sister is Sai, because Nijima? If something disappointing were to happen here, that wouldn't reflect very well on your sister. Yeah, and this is another typical uh, underhanded... I'm going to call it underhanded. This is uh, basically... It's not quite blackmailing or quite threatening, but it's very heavily handed that, like, you know, you screw this up there, then, you know, apple doesn't fall far from the tree sort of thing. If you're a screw-up, then maybe she's a screw-up, and that's really has absolutely nothing to do with anything, but the mentality... Uh, it very clearly um, uh, says differently in uh, in Japan anyway. Do you understand? If that even made sense, what I said. It made sense to me, but uh, I don't know if I really said it in such a way that actually was coherent. Yes. And of course, that reaction to, yes, like, I understand, like, clearly she wants to do this. Very so, very clearly. <laughs> How wise. It's no wonder you're our student council president. So this was our, uh, she was actually sitting in the library. She was telling us not to, to disturb her when we talked to her. I'd appreciate if you'd look into this as soon as possible. I ask that you begin at once. And now we know she is the student council president. Yes, if you'll excuse me then. It's me, sir. My apologies for troubling you at such a busy time. Yes, it's about the matter we discussed earlier. I have all bases covered. The investigation will begin immediately. Mm hmm of course. Yes, I will get results. I should be able to update you soon. Well then, I must be going. Thank you very much for your time.
So who was he talking to? I actually know, but I don't remember if we've seen Endgame yet. Uh, the police are really here. I saw them at the entrance. You're texting us in class again. Yeah, she saw them too. We're talking to the teachers. Well, of course. They're here to question uh, people and whatnot, find out what's going on. That change of heart thing's seriously amazing, huh? I hope they don't find out we're responsible. How could they find out we're responsible? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we'll be fine. There's no proof it was us. If there was no proof it was anyone. That not that the, the point behind uh, us doing it? Well, one of them, anyway. Don't need to worry. I'm concerned. Should we turn ourselves in? No, we don't need to worry. From what we know so far, and what we've seen, there's no way anyone can trace it to us, unless somebody saw us, like, going into the, the metaverse or whatnot. Like, other than that, like, there's no trace of anything. And honestly, who would believe that story? Sound sure of yourself? Well, yeah, come on, have some confidence in ourselves here, Jesus. But I mean, haven't rumors been going around about how you guys threatened Kamoshida? Oh yeah, there is that. This world's Kamoshida just didn't know anything about what actually happened to him, though. Yeah, still. We did what was right. Don't go freaking out over some label. I guess it's true. That and what's done is done. We can't exactly go back and change it. Uh, I really can't wait to keep living this double life. Oh my god, of course you're excited about it. Alright, Darren, we're gonna be counting on you. Hey. Oh, Mishima. Have you seen that Phantom Aficionado website? The what site? Uh, I have heard of it. I'm the one who started it. Okay, why did you do this? Um, you guys are the Phantom Thieves, aren't you? Oh, that's a that's a hell of a conclusion to jump to. <laughs> Give me some space. <laughs> yeah, you're too close, bud. Back up. Sorry. Although. If things really are as I think, I should keep it a secret. Um... Yeah? Kamoshida used me, and I did some horrible things to you guys. This isn't much of a way for me to apologize for it. But if there's anything I can do to help, just let me know. Um... Yeah, that's great, but, um... Uh... Glad to hear that. But no, you're you're missing the butt in there. There are many more evil adults outside of Kamoshida. Maybe I should have said this is a misunderstanding. But I'm sure the Phantom Thieves will do something. They can't let this end after just one target. And how would you know that? That's why I wanted to make a forum where people could post their problems. There are probably a lot of people who have high hopes for the Phantom Thieves' next move. Yeah. Um, not sure how I feel about that one, to be honest. So, I've also implemented an anonymous poll in the site. Do you believe in the Phantom Thieves or not? I hope someday my forum is filled with supportful posts. I'd really like to help out in the Phantom Thieves acts of justice. Can I, please? Oh, here's a nice, here's a nice non-choice here. Wow. It's up to you? Sounds like fun. No, to me, honestly, this doesn't sound like a good idea. And these, like, it's all en ends up at the same point, so... Do what you want. I'm gonna at least be indifferent. Yeah, I will. Those are terrible choices. <laughs> Sense an abundantly high expectations from Mishima. Okay, where's Sai going with this one? Oh, someone to rally support, maybe. 
Besides the public's reaction to your group, there were others who supported you. Someone who enthusiastically cheered the Phantom Thieves on. Perhaps they were quite close. Well, you go right to the point, like, really in there with that. How do you get that? What do you have to say to that? <laughs> I say a jump cut I to a confident. Thou art I. That was acquired a new vow. We've seen this a few times before. With the birth of the moon, the moon persona, persona. I have obtained the winds of. Okay. Mishima's support allows backup members to earn XP. This is actually uh, a confident uh, or social link here that I do want to max out, and not for, not necessarily just for the uh, right. the abilities you get, but for the persona that it unlocks at the end. See you. We heard all that. Yeah, of course. He wasn't exactly quiet now, was he? Oh god, did we just get another Ryuji? Jeez. It was a little awkward trying to figure out when to walk over here. So that forum is Mishima-kun's. Has he figured out our identities? Yeah, well, it probably wasn't too hard, honestly. Considering how vigorously we were going after Kamoshida and how we were trying to get information out of him, and then all this happens, it's not a very big leap to think we had something to do with it. Even so, I think it'll be fine. He seemed to be playing it cool. Yeah, I'm more worried about him slipping up unintentionally. You know, kind of like Ryuji maybe saying something a little too loud and having the wrong person hear it. I guess we should have a little chat about this later. Yeah. I will say, though, a forum where people can post problems may prove unexpectedly useful. Of course it will, unexpectedly. Anyways, we gotta get looking for a new target. And we need to stay sharp until we manage to find one. Once we do, we'll have to head into another palace. So we should prep our equipment and... Wait! Oh, crap! Huh? What's with you? Don't we have an exam coming up? Alright, why do you remember that? Out of everyone here, why is it you who remembers that? Judging by that reaction, I'd assume you're going to struggle this time, too. It's not like you're any better. All you're good at is English. That just sounds ironic considering we're all speaking English. That than be bad at every subject. Fair point, Anne. What do you have to say to that, Ryuji? Even your Japanese is questionable at best, Ryuji. Uh, that's just kind of funny. What's questionable is whether you're really even a human. No, I don't think that's questionable. I don't think he, I don't think he is human at all. I think he's a cat. <laughs> Good comeback, huh? No, not really. Let's discuss this with our fists! You mean pause? Bring it! Okay, now that was a missed opportunity, Ryuji. Come on. Will you two stop it? Yeah, seriously. If anybody looks over here, you're arguing with a cat that shouldn't be in school. Okay. Yeah, let's... <laughs> Let's not draw any attention to ourselves in Thunder next Okay, so what we were just doing, we're in a class full of people, apparently. Draw. Let's not draw attention to ourselves. What just happened then? Don't forget to study, though. I won't have time of blaming me if your grades start dropping. Really? We're going to get a splash screen about this. Okay, this, obviously, obviously, this should have been a given. And we've already had this point right here driven home by the last time we were in the Velvet Room. What the hell, game? Redundancy is redundant, I say as I look down and see exactly 30 minutes on my time here. 
So, I think at 30 minutes this is a good time to call it. Um, thank you all for watching. Hope you fully... Hope you fully... Wow! It is a good time to call it. Clearly my English is suffering more than usual. Hopefully you enjoyed, and uh, come back and see what we do for the rest of this day going on in, until we find our next uh, target and act like an honest student, which is nice and new and put up there. Is there a way to act like a dishonest student, I wonder? Anyway, until next time, guys, take care, you here.